years old. I should be watching Judy fucking Judy in the house. <laughs> well, that's not what came across when you thought today we've been following you on Facebook, on Twitter. The way you've been working and preparing yourself for this fight. You've had a change of opponent, but you're here and you've conquered. Yeah, I started 14 weeks out. 14 weeks of pure hell. I trained a Spartan performance. Jack Lovett. There's the man there, put me through hell with strength and conditioning. I've never done strength and conditioning ever in my life. It killed me. Phil the Freak, UK number one heavyweight, look at him. The man is a monster, he kicked up the shit out of me for 14 weeks. Jill from Heron, British and Intercontinental Champion. He was the second one to jump on us and kick the shit out of us. But the man who sat with me, he took time, he dedicated himself. He pretended he was weak when he was fighting me. He went through all the technical stuff, all the boring shit that you hear doing. But he spent time with me and, and he believed in me, Richie Knox. I love that man a bit. But my whole team, my whole team, and let's not forget Machine and Amir. Yeah. I couldn't do with them guys. I didn't train with them as much as I would like to, only because of the level that they are. I mean, I've trained with the best in the country. But Machine and Amir guys, they took a beating off me. And I love you as well. Thank you guys. It sounds like you've had the right people around you. You've got strength and condition, you've got striking, you've got groundwork. He seemed to work here with the strikes initially. You took him down and you went straight in and went in for the kill. Yeah, the height, the height was it. I mean, I've got Phil to spar with, he's high, he's tall. But I couldn't really catch Phil with the height. And I thought the height was going to be a slight disadvantage towards me. But people forget, it's been five years since I've been in the cage. Five years, that's, that's a long time. A long time. So I had the little bits of doubt in the back of my mind. Can I still do it? Fair enough, you can do it in training. You still beat people up in training. But that's in a comfortable environment. Here, with all you lot staring at me, watching me, going, let's see if he is too old. Let's see if that five years off actually works. My God, I am so fucking happy. But well, the thing is, Ian, you proved it. The hate is wrong and you proved the support was right. You've come in here, you came with them leg kicks, you chopped him down, the height didn't mean anything, you dealt with him on the floor. Richie Knox, Richie Knox is the man. Richie, raise your hand. Richie Knox, he's the man who went his leg kicks. Use your leg kicks. Obviously, I was a bit worried in case Ringo shot in as I was throwing the leg kick. That's a, but my sprawl has been super fast. Phil the Freeze is one of the fastest shoots I can, I've ever trained with. And Phil had a hard job taking me down, so I knew, I knew Ringo couldn't do it. But, eh, uh, I think I broke my hand off. <laughs> kicking him. It actually hurts. It's actually a big swollen. But I'll tell you what it is, guys. You better buy me a fucking pint. I've been on a diet for 14 weeks in Hawaii. Ladies and gentlemen, it's been an honor to MC this guy. One, one, one quick thank you. One quick thank you. Or two, actually. One is to Rico. Rico. I mean, this man is a former UFC heavyweight champion of the world. I mean, look at the condition he's in. He's looking absolutely fantastic. I just want to say thank you guys so much for the opportunity. The fight changed the last week. Um, I'm just not honored to fight Ian. He's a stud and he was a class act as a gentleman. It's our job in this martial artist to promote the sport in a positive way. Without you guys, we wouldn't be here. Ian, thank you so much for having me. What a gentleman, Mr. Rodriguez. Ladies and gentlemen. Oh, hold on, we haven't finished yet. I'm on, I'm on. I've got a beautiful lady out there. My beautiful wife. Baby, I love you. <laughs>